Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Little Sean in the house. Above the books, stigmatism in my soul. Above for 15, go on. Gundy Publishing. Big Dot Cartel, something? Gundy Publishing. Gundy Publishing. Dot Big Cartel. Dot Big Cartel. Dot com, man. And get the, and get the fly t-shirts, because... Me and my dad made them. Not no fakers. Peace. All right, y'all. What's up, man? I'm finna make some. Uh, I'm gonna make some uh, some grits, eggs, and fish. Fish and grits with eggs, man. You understand? But my stove is a little dirty, so we're gonna clean that off first. So let's get this out of the way. <coughs> Clean this out. Let me clean this. I had already took this out. Who was that over there? I spray this on my stove. This is that fantastic you get from the Dollar Tree. I spray that on my stove. Then I come and get some paper towel. I like to clean. I like to be clean when I cook, man. I like to be clean when I cook, man. I clean my stove after I cook. I clean my stove after every time I cook, man. I clean my stove, man. All right, so we got that out the way. We wash our hands. So we're gonna make some grits, scrambled eggs. We're gonna put some tuna fish in that joint. Put our joints back on, stove nice and clean, so now we can cook. All right, so this is, I make my grits in the pot like this. You just start off with regular water, right? So turn the flame on. You want to bring that water to a boil, right? I got my grits right here. Let me get my salt and my black pepper. Let me get some butter. You gotta have the butter for the grits. You ain't got no butter for your grits. You ain't making no real grits. All right, so we got that working. Let's get the frying pan out for the eggs. I got the dope old school frying pan. Look at that right there. Dope frying pan. Rinse your frying pan off. Rinse your frying pan off. Don't be dirty. Put that on the stove. Let's get that working. Let's get our eggs. How many eggs y'all want to eat? Let's get two. We're going to get two of them joints. We got the two eggs. Where the coffee by that? Let's make some coffee with it too. Put the coffee back there. Get that going. So I got a bunch of things going at one time because I could do that. All right, so with my coconut oil at? So, I put my coconut oil in here, right, so that the eggs don't stick. But, with just the coconut oil, the eggs are still stick, so to really don't make them stick, to guarantee, I take a little butter, put a little butter joint in there. Yeah, you hear that joint popping? Look at that right there. Look at that joint popping. So you get the butter. Get the butter going all around. All right, so let's chill with that for a minute. All right, so we got the grits. This is the boil water. You understand? So what I do, how I make my grits, while my water's boiling, I put my salt in the water while the water boiling. Check me out. That's how I make my joint. Then I put the pepper in there too. Put the pepper in there too. Don't be biting my style neither. Keep making them the way he was making them because you wasn't making them like that. No, you wasn't. No, you wasn't. So don't be going trying to make them like that now because you saw me make them like that. Keep making them your way. I got my own style how I make mine. All right, so we got the butter here. Come on, man. Y'all stuck, stuck to the paper. All right, so then I take a little butter. I ain't even put no grits in there yet. I ain't even put no grits in there yet. I ain't even put no 
Christian here yet. All right, so that's the coffee. Got the eggs ready. All right, what else? Let's get our coffee pot ready. Coffee cup. Yo, this is a good breakfast, man. You can make this with ham. You can make this with bacon. You can make this with uh, sausage. But I'm going to make it with... Um, all right, so my water's starting to boil. So let's get the eggs rocking. That's the... Um, let's get the eggs rocking. Let's get the eggs rocking. Turn the flame on. There you go. Come on up. There you go. So our grits is getting right. They're getting right. Get our tray table ready. Get our tray table ready. All right, so let's go. The water's boiling now. So my, 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 my grits water is boiling. Let's take our grits and put our grits in there. Put a nice little scoop in there. Now what you got to do with your grits, as soon as you put them in your boiling water, the water got to be boiling first. You got to stir them up so they don't lump up. If you don't stir them up, they'll lump up. Let me turn that joint up. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. All right, so we got our grits in there. We put a little more on them. A little more. Uh, all right. All right, so let's get our eggs joint right. I don't like to leave the fire on the egg, on the, uh, the coconut oil, and the, and the butter too long because it'll burn then your eggs be having a different color. Then your eggs be a different color and whatnot. I don't like that. <clears throat> All right, so we got our eggs going. Put a little salt on the eggs. Keep stirring up your grits. All right, now you bring the, the flame down on the grits to real low. Bring it down real low. Bring it down real low like your self-esteem, real low. First you have it up high, like my self-esteem. Then once they start boiling, then you bring it down and you just let it simmer. All right, we got our eggs. Look at that egg right there. Coffee water getting straight. So I'm still stirring the grits. I'm going to take another little piece of butter, stir it up in my grits. Look at that egg right there. Look at that egg right there. Look at this. Watch this here. Oh! Uh, look at that joint. Yeah! All right, so the grits don't take long to make, man. The grits don't take long. So they still simmering a little bit. Then what I do, once you, uh, once they, so they ready. So I turn the flame all the way off, and then you put a cap on that joint so that it could take away all of the um, the excess water that's in there. So we got our egg. The egg is cooking. Let's get the fish. Let's get the fish joint. All right. So we got some solid white albacore tuna, Trader Joe's. 
29 grams of protein. This is Trader Joe's brand. This is Trader Joe's Albacore. There you go. Get him, Sean. I got him. So we got our fish, two eggs, 12 grams of protein, 6 grams of protein per egg, um, 12 grams of protein, 29 grams of protein, what is that, 41 grams of protein, just your, just your eggs and your fish, how much protein in here, 3 grams of protein, 45 grams of protein, we'll see, good meal, man. This is something that I would eat like post-workout, you know what I'm saying? So let's get our bowl, we're gonna put everything in here. Grits. All right, they're looking good. Still got a little bit of excess water. You know what I'm saying? You may like your grits. You may like your grits soupy. I don't like mine soupy. Right? I don't like them soupy, and I don't like them super thick to where they're almost too chunky. I like it in between. You know what I'm saying? So I know how I like them. So I wait for it to get like that. I got my egg, right? We got the the, uh, the tuna fish. Let's get this can, right? So we got this drink the juice out of the tuna fish can. All that protein. So we got our fish. So now we're just going to wait on the... Um, we're going to grits. They're almost ready. I'm going to give it about uh, maybe about four more minutes. But in the meantime, let's get our coffee right. Let's get the Mexican joint. We're going to do the legal. Let's get the Mexican coffee right. Put a nice little scoop in there. Nice little scoop. Let's get some uh, French vanilla. Somebody call me. Y'all hear my phone? French vanilla. I'm doing a video. Stop calling me. A little French vanilla in there. I'm calling you back. I'm with my people here. We're making a video. I put just a little bit of this. Once I put the French vanilla, or if I put the hazelnut in there, the hazelnut, I'll put a little bit of this in there. Just to give it a little bit more color. All right, so we got. Let's make sure our let's make sure our water's still super hot. We want our water to be super hot. I like to hear that sound when it when it whistles. All right, let's check on our grits. All right, our grits is getting money. Our grits is getting money. There it go. Look at this right here. Look at that right there. That's old school coffee. You know that coffee money. You know that coffee hot right there. You know that coffee hot. I love my coffee. Love coffee, man. That's why I make my coffee better than you. Because I love coffee more than you do. Put a little honey in that joint, man. Local, natural, raw, 100% pure. Put a little scoop in there. I gotta go get some more, that's too much. This good right here. I gotta go get some more of this honey. Where I got this honey from? Where I get this honey from? I forgot where I got, where I get that honey from right there. You remember where I got that honey from? I don't think I got it from Whole Foods. 
Where I get that honey from? All right. So let's uh let's go ahead and get busy. All right. So let's let's turn this joint around so y'all can see good what's going on here. So we got the grits. Pour all the grits in there. You gotta get all the grits out. You hear me scraping that pot? You gotta scrape that pot right there. There you go. You gotta scrape that pot. Get all the grits out, the slave style. Look at the grits, them grits hot. So then I, I take another load. I know I put butter in there, so I put a little more in there. You know what I'm saying? A little more salt. This is slave food, man. This is slave food. This is why I look as good as I look. I'm 53 years old. I don't look it, do I? I know I don't. I know I don't, because I look good. All right, so we got our egg. Let's put the egg joint in there. Look at the egg right there. Do the egg in there. Now, we get our tuna fish. Look at this right here. Look at that. Put that joint in there. Get it all out of there. All right. So we ready to eat now, man. We ready to eat. Put my butter back in the refrigerator. I may need some more. I may need some more. All right, y'all, let's eat. Say the grace. You say it, Grace. Say it. I, I say. God, thank you for the food that we about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies, our minds, and our spirits. Amen. All right, so we got everything in here. We got the grits. This is 45 grams of protein right here, man. Clean protein. This is some soul food right here. This is black American soul food. This is black American soul food. From slavery. This is why we so athletic and our genetics is so good. We got the best genetics in the world. We need slave food. That's why I look like this. I look good, don't I? Yeah, I know I do. I see myself every day. When I get out the shower right there, I got a big mirror right there. And I look, I see myself every day. My abs ain't in yet, but they coming. They'll be here by April. I bet you they'll be here by April. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. See, this is so good. I got to pick the bowl up. Sweatshirt. I saw it too cool to be embarrassed. Too cool to be embarrassed. This is good eating. You mix it all together. You don't, this ain't like all the rich elites. You know what I'm saying? That go to Davos, all the rich white dudes that go to Davos, Switzerland, all the elites. They have one food here, one food there. And they... Now we don't do that. You put all that shit in the pot together, you put it all in there together, 
When you get down, Jack. Mm-hmm. Just like that. Just like that, right there. Mm-hmm. I got enough butter. I don't need no more butter. Got enough salt and pepper in here. A little coffee joint. All right, so y'all, that's how you make fish and grits and eggs. That's how I make them. Now, you could fry you some fish. You could fry you some tilapia. You could fry you some whiting. You could fry you some flounder, some catfish. Whatever kind of fish you like. And throw it in there the same way. You make the grits the same way with the eggs. I just chose to make mine with tuna fish. You could use sardines, you could use mackerels. When I was in prison, I used to use mackerels. I used to use mackerels. In Puerto Rican nigga, used to steal boiled eggs out of the kitchen. I would buy five, I would buy like 10 from him, five for a dollar. So I'd give him two dollars, he'd give me 10 eggs. So the next morning I'm with the breakfast, I'd take me down an egg, a pack of mackerels, and I would get grits, because they used to have grits every morning on Mainline when I was at Morgantown. And I would make my fish and grits and eggs in the morning. And then I used to go goddamn rep 315 on the bench press. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I did. That's a true story. All right, y'all. Peace.